before you part, there's just one story I want to tell you. So I used to teach data structures back when uh, I was an undergrad as well. And I remember one time a student came to me in office hours, and they asked, you know, what is this course for? And so you know, I told them Java is a very popular programming language. And so you'll probably be using it in your upper level classes, probably your internships, maybe your future career. So it's good to get to know it now. And for context, in our data structures course, that was the first time people saw Java. So why Java? It's very possibly useful in the future. The same thing with all the data structures you're learning in this course, too. I mean, linked lists, trees, hash tables, graphs, they really form the core of what it is to be a computer scientist. <laughs> but then the student asks him, but, but what is it all for? Why do I sit at a computer all day writing code? So I stood there and thought about it for a while. A few days, really. And this is what I told him. Take linked lists, for example. They're pretty helpful. <laughs> what solves collisions in a hash table? Use a linked list. Every time you hit the undo button in Photoshop or the back button in Firefox, that's a linked list. They're so meta, they form the backbone of Git, software that's used to develop most of the world's other software. And have you ever tried to link a node back to itself? Now that's meta. But what about trees? Trees gave our data a hierarchy with the roots and its children, <laughs> family trees, and indeed, the entire animal kingdom is a tree, a tree of evolution. Every sentence or phrase ever spoken is a tree, a tree of syntax. And what about graphs? Graphs represent the fundamental network of our generation, the internet. They represent transportation, the fundamental network of all generations. They represent your social connections, and through them, every friend or foe, love or loss you've ever known. The human condition. They represent the neurons in our brain. And with them, every memory in all of history, life itself. Physicists use them to model the interactions between atoms. And astronomers use them to model the night sky. Graphs are all that ever was, and all that ever will be. And you command them now. You have that power. Computer science frontier of problems. Solved, unsolved, and impossible. But in three short months, you've begun a lifelong quest to make impossible dreams a reality. With linkless your rope, trees your horizon, and graphs your guide. Search for those keys, the keys that unlock the values of the things you hold most, and keep those keys and values close in a hashtag.